Good morning. It is an absolutely beautiful morning. I, I just, I can't get over these beautiful clouds, how pretty it is. It's nice and cool. It's, uh, I don't know, maybe 50 degrees Fahrenheit. It's, uh, hello rooster. Um, I've been having a good walk and a good chat with myself, trying to think of what to talk about that I haven't talked about a lot before in the recent months. And nothing's coming to mind, actually. I thought of saying a lot of the things I've already said before talking about positivity, the correct action to take, building with, building positively with others, uh, focusing your, your pro-white energy in healthy, constructive ways instead of destructive ways. And all of that just, it didn't feel genuine today, so I don't have anything planned. I just thought we would walk together and take a pleasant morning walk where I share my thoughts as they come to me, instead of having something prepared this time. For the last few months, I've been doing my best to have a topic prepared to speak on before I start uh, the, the morning recording, but we're not doing that today. We're just going to shoot from the hip, so to speak, and uh, here is this lovely farm. Uh, that this, this entire homestead just went up in the last year, but they've got chickens and ducks. They've got a nice garden down here where they're growing some foods. They have multiple horses. I think they have eight, and uh, it's just a really nice little homestead ranch place here. It's really nice. And of course, uh, they bought and worked the property adjoining my favorite tree over there by that nice rear-painted horse there. Hi, buddy. That's the one that talks to me at the fence sometimes in the morning on my walks. Okay, so the camping trip is coming up soon, and uh, you should definitely come visit. Uh, Reptile and his, and his wife, the ones that got me this cool Go Free jersey, they're going to be there. We've got Promethean Promulgation coming. He's the one that uh, rode with me uh, to the Texas event earlier this year. We have some friends who I'm not allowed to name that are coming from the basket weaving community. We have a man and his wife coming up from Georgia. We have a new friend that I've made uh, who uh, is coming over from North Carolina. And we have a couple of the... Oop, I almost stepped on a worm. Uh, we have a couple of people coming from the, uh, the um, U.S. Patriot MAGA community. So to, not really MAGA anymore, but like... The people, some of the people that I met that are particularly based uh, from the MAGA events of the last six years, uh, a couple of them from Don the Plebs community uh, are coming as well. So we're up to about 10 people now. So that should be fun. Uh, there are a couple of others that are maybes at this point that said they would get back to me in the next month and let me know. So we should have at least 9 or 10, maybe as many as 12 or 13 at my camping trip. So that will be the weekend of October 20th, as I have talked about many times. Let me know if you want to join. It doesn't cost you anything other than you getting here out to East Tennessee. Excuse me. And, um, of course, um, I have um, the, the kind folks that follow me have already financially supported everything I need to pay for the camping event. But, uh, of course, you can always donate more, and any extra will go directly to extra ammo for the, uh, for the range on Saturday. So... Hopefully that will be a great time, and uh, we'll have a great time of fellowship and cooking my delicious meat treats and having a great day on Saturday putting thousands of rounds down range. And uh, there's a car coming. I have to pause. It, uh, it was particularly loud for a little car. Anyway, um, where was I? Camping trip, yes. Um, so that's basically the long and short of it. If you want to come, come have a good time with us. We eat a lot of delicious meat that I grill myself. We have a lot of beautiful nature walks, and we put a lot of rounds down range. Uh, it's a good old patriotic American fun time. So, if that sounds like your cup of tea, you get in touch with me. Uh, four places here you can get in touch with me. You can send me an email. Use the Unica Proton Mail. Let me know that you are interested in the camping trip and get details from me because I have to personally vet you and speak to you if I don't know you personally already uh, for you to come to my events. So, you have to get on the ball with that. Or... You're going to put it off and you're going to want to come and I'm not going to let you. So, you need to get on that. Well, I know what we can do, since I don't have anything planned. We can't go over to that pond as much as I would absolutely love to. I had to make a surprise cut because a really loud SUV just buzzed over the hill going about 50. So, uh, shame on them. They shouldn't go that fast here. Shame on them. Anyway, I was about to say... I want to go over to that pond, but it's on private property, so as much as I would love to take a walk over there and look at the beautiful green algae-covered or moss-covered pond, we're going to go over to this other little pond that I am allowed to go to. Now, we're going to go up real quiet-like, and we are going to see if we can spot some frogs or some birds before they 
jump in the water or fly away. So we're going to be real quiet. We're going to sneak up on him here. Let's see what we can see. Unfortunately, no frogs, no birds. Oh, no, there was one hiding in the grass there. There was another one over there. They're so hard to spot because they're little. They're only, they're only like this big. Sometimes there's bullfrogs. You know, they get like the size of your hand. But usually the frogs here are really small. But there was a couple of little frogs I just couldn't see hiding in the grass there. But this is a beautiful little place. I know this is just a drainage pond, but it's still cute. And it's got some nice houses that adjoin it. And uh, it's just real sweet. It's a nice little area here. <sighs> well, I didn't have anything else to say today. We'll wrap this up and keep it short. Uh, nothing profound or really meaningful came to me on my little walk today. And uh, I've already been out here like 20 minutes. Just having a stroll about, having a good time. And I've got about another half mile to go before I get back to my place. So I'm going to go ahead and wrap it up here. Uh, I hope you guys have a wonderful day and a wonderful week. And uh, I'm recording this on Monday morning before I start putting together my Discordant Dragon stream. So it's quite possible I'll do another morning walk video this week. We'll see. But anyway, I'm going to save my voice for the stream tonight. And I woke up feeling pretty crappy, but my walk this morning has taken all that away. I don't feel ill at all, and I feel great. So... Hopefully that's a good omen of uh, things to come. I hope the stream tonight goes well. And then I have a good week. And uh, maybe I'll have an extra stream this week. We'll see. But uh, I don't know yet. Uh, I have some irons in the fire when it comes to stream guests. And I've been having trouble nailing down new stream guests for things. But could just be the nature of the beast. I could be getting old or uh, useless. I don't know. But I've been having trouble finding new stream guests and uh, getting new stream spots. So... I don't know. Maybe that's a me problem. I don't know. But I'm working on it. Uh, I'll continue trying to grow and get more people involved in my channel and get myself involved in other people's channels. So we'll see what comes of that. But regardless, if I don't make another video this week, I hope you all have a blessed weekend and I'll see you Monday for Discordant Dragons. But I might see you in a, in a tomorrow or the next day because I'll probably be able to do another morning walk video this week since it's just now Monday. So there's a vehicle coming, so I'm going to have to pause one more time before I say goodbye. And there it goes. Okay. Um, <laughs> a lot of interruptions today, but uh, I guess that's just how it goes some mornings. Anyway, I'll probably make another morning walk video this week. But if I don't, have a great weekend and all that, and I'll see you next Monday. Enjoy the beautiful pond. God bless.